Uh, I don't appreciate being summoned like some low-level clerk. Actually, Alan didn't summon you. I did. Gus, you're back. Yes. Good. Here I am. Good, 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 good. I can use you. <laughs> really? What, to muscle Harley and the Cooper family? Oh, okay. Well, I see Alan has filled you in. That's also good. All right. All I'm trying to do is put Spalding back where it belongs. And right now, company happens to be in the way. It's a big job. We all need to stand together. Hmm. Well, I won't be standing with you, okay? And company's off limits. Would you tell him that? Yes. Tell me, Dad. Philip, Gus's question is, why should a very popular neighborhood restaurant have to go? It's in the way. You can't get another piece of land that you need for your project, like, that's actually for sale? You can't do that? Hang on a second, Gus. I, I honestly, I don't understand. Why are you sticking up for those people? Excuse me, those people? Yes, those people. Harley dumped you at your wedding. Buzz and Frank helped put your aunt in jail. You don't owe the Coopers a thing. I lied to the woman I was going to marry. You don't, you don't think there's something wrong with that? You lied to protect your family. I think that's honorable. I agree with your brother on that one, Gus. You can, can you pick a side, Al? Because you can't just have it both ways, all right? <laughs> it's kind of fun watching him try, though, isn't it? <laughs> you are twisted, man. Uh, well, no argument here. Better than being lovesick. Oh, come on, Gus. Now, look, you, you know I was off for your wedding, and you know I'm fond of Harley. But take a step back and think about it. She doesn't deserve your loyalty. But, and you do? I'm your family. Big freaking deal. I trust her. I don't trust you. What have I ever done to you? Philip, at least consider discussing altering your plans for company. I mean, it's to our advantage to have Gus's input. He's fair, has a sense of vision. Input is one thing. Interference is completely different, and I won't tolerate it. Let me tell you something. If you're going to crush Harley and her family, you're going to have to do that to me as well, all right? Wait a minute, Gus. Gus, where are you going? I'm going to have a little conversation with Harley. And uh, Peter Burns is interested in coming on board as well, provided we can keep his name out of it. Hello, gentlemen. Oh. Gentlemen. My mistake. Um, Olivia, you can't just walk in here like this. We're stockholders, Alan. Show a little respect, huh? We heard about your latest endeavor, Philip, taking over company. You really should know how difficult it is to get the smell of grease out of your hair. Right, can I get some Philip fries with my Buzz Burger? I mean, please. In case you two haven't noticed, we're running a business here. And so are we. Slingshot Enterprises. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sounds like some kind of a hillbilly <laughs> company or something. Yeah. Said goodbye to David, and look what happened to him. I'm going to call security. Oh, no, no, no. Let her, let her huff and puff all she wants. I don't think she's going to blow the house down. You would underestimate me again, but don't say we didn't warn you. I... I thought that your only objective in betting young Bill here was to attach yourself to a free Lewis, as you've now run out of Spaldings. Well, huh. Philip, we're business partners now. Yeah. You have to excuse me, Bill. I, I've known Olivia a lot longer than you have. I, I happen to know that her real talent does not lie in the boardroom. Well, tell me, who kept this ship afloat while you were over at Ravenwood eating soup through a straw? Go back to your sandbox, Bill. And... Take your slut of a nanny here with you. Ooh. Okay, why don't you watch your mouth Stop there, it. big Don't guy, right? <clears throat> the way I see it's or what? Only has one way to go, and that's down. Mm -hmm. There, right, a little uh, promotional tool for you. And remember, took David just one rock. Once a climber, always a climber. Oh, she's predictable, all right. You know, I do pity Bill. Oh, I wouldn't. They're perfectly positioned. You want them together? Oh, yes. Absolutely. Right up until the final move of the game. Done. Sandy is officially excused from the internship program. Oh, good. I knew I ran into the right Spalding. Alan would have fought me. Oh, well. Alan can be difficult sometimes. But that's okay. You just have to know how to handle it. <laughs> and we both know how to do that. That's right, we do. Listen, 
while I'm doing you a favor, maybe you can do me one. Sure. I understand that you're doing a story about some restaurant that's closing down. It's company, <laughs> Philip. I'm, I'm sure I have your angle on this. I'm sure it's a great human interest thing, big business versus the little guy. That's exactly what it is. But I promise I'll be fair. Yeah. Um, I want you to kill it. Kill it? Why? Because I'm asking you to. Or actually, I'm telling you. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> I'm your new boss. Yeah, I bought the station. <laughs>